welcome back to another lip <laughs> let's try that again another nail polish review this is by a brand called helios and it's from their luminora line of smart nail polishes which i did not know was a thing that existed smart nail polish what is that um i've got the box nearby this is in the shade live and lovely now initially when i got this in my ipsy bag or box whatever i got it in just in the bottle like it's an almost dusty rose, it's like almost like a hint of brownish or gray in there. I didn't think I was gonna be that in love with this color, but boy, there's a difference between in the bottle versus actually on my hands. I have been in love with this shade since I tried it. I've been wearing this for about a month because I love it so much. I just oh, I can't get enough of it, but this one, I definitely could see myself buying some more shades from this line, just given how this behaves. So let me read the stuff on the box to you about it. So the Helios Smart Nail Polish in Live and Lovely. Helios Luminor is a smart nail polish with a photo initiator for a gel-like look in long wear time. This formula cures in natural light with no need for a UV or LED lamp, which is amazing because I don't own one. <laughs> um, Combine it with Helios Luminor Top Coat for extra shine with a maximum wear time of up to 10 days. Tips for longer wear time. Clean nails with oil-free nail polish remover. Do not touch with fingers. Apply a thin first, er, yes, a first thin coat. Seal the tip of the nail and let dry for two minutes. Apply a second coat and let dry completely. For extended wear time, apply Luminor Top Coat and let dry completely. Enjoy your Helios manicure. Well, I don't have the Helios Top Coat. But I do have a top coat, so um, the first time I put it on, I put it on with, I believe, three coats and then a top coat, and just saw how long that wore. And it did indeed last about 10 days, as advertised, which is very unusual, because usually it seems like by the second time I shower, they're peeling up and popping off, and they're all stupid, and just, I don't know. This one actually did the thing, and lived up to its claims. I'm so shocked. That almost never happens with nail polish whenever they make a very specific claim like that, but this one actually works. And it wasn't a fluke because I put it back on and done it again a couple more times now, and it definitely works with or without a top coat. This time, I have one hand with top coat, one hand without. Same number of coats of polish, though. Uh, in terms of shine, it's pretty close. Even without the top coat, it's still pretty shiny, guys. But it does look nicer with a top coat. But then again, I like shiny. If you don't like shiny, if you like a matte finish, throw a matte top coat on there. <laughs> but, um, uh, because, yeah, this is going to be shiny either way for you. But regardless, even when it started to chip, it was just minor chippage for several days even then before it started actually, like, peeling all the way off of fingernails and such. But this stuff retails for twelve fifty. For how nicely it wears... For how nicely it applies, for how quickly it dries, and the fact that it has a photo initiator that doesn't require any UV lamps or anything, I am shook that this is only $12.50 a bottle. And while normally I would balk at $12.50 a bottle for nail polish because that's more than I'm used to paying, I'm used to paying for like OPI stuff that's like six to eight bucks to pay, uh, depending on the shade. And given the technology here and how well it plays just in general, I would pay that for more of this in like more ideal shades that I would be even more into wearing. So I am highly considering investing in some more of their line because holy crap guys, this polish I feel like is game changing. As somebody who's never done like proper gel polishes or anything because again, don't have the lamp for it uh, and doesn't do acrylic nails, this is like the next best thing. So if you're like me and you don't want to invest in all that stuff, this is a very, very good alternative for you. I swear to you. I'm just really, really shocked. And the bottle itself feels like so luxe. It just is really thick glass. The cap is rubberized, so it helps you not slip or drop it or anything. No mistakes here because it stays really nicely in your hand. We've got the embossed logo on the side. Just everything about it just feels so luxurious and nice. And is this one that has the actual bead in it? It does. It does have the little mixy beads in there, which I feel like are barely ever a thing anymore. And I always miss it because it works so much better when they have them. 
So I'm so stoked that this is one that has it. But yeah, for as iffy as I initially was on this shade, I've actually quickly fallen in love with this shade and really, really like it, which is surprising. So, I don't know. I really, really highly suggest this to you guys. Even if this particular shade isn't your jam, go look at their site. They make so many colors and just about everything under the sun. There is definitely something that will catch your fancy. I am positive about it. So, anyway guys, that is it for this one from me. So, as usual, you guys know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. So, anyway guys, till next time, bye-bye.